You're watching Action News Now. Storm Tracker weather coverage you can count on. Started out a little bit cloudy, but the skies cleared out into a beautiful blue. This is the time lapse over the Sutter Buttes this afternoon today. What a cool shot that is. Chief Meteorologist Jason Stiff is tracking the ever changing weather forecast. Jason, really nice today, but what can we expect tonight, tomorrow? Keeps changing. It does. Weather's always changing. Otherwise, I wouldn't even have a job. Why would I be here? But yes, we do have some more clouds that are going to be moving our direction, even some chances for some light rain, but don't expect a lot of rain. Do want to show you a really pretty view. Look at this. Almost looks like a UFO that's over Mount Shasta. Oh, and right there, as we keep losing the light, it actually went from color to black and white. But look at that. The moon getting obscured by one of those clouds over Mount Shasta. A beautiful evening in store. You may not be able to see much in the sky, though, for a while because we have both higher clouds as well as the low clouds and fog. They're going to start pushing back into the valley. Right now, 58 degrees in Redding after a high today of 69. 57 degrees in Chico. It's 53 in Paradise, but it's only 45 cool degrees in Bernie and Chester. We don't have a lot of wind. Everyone less than 10 miles an hour. So that allows for the potential for some of that fog to set up again over the valley. Some of our mountain valleys could have a foggy night also. We also have those high thin cirrus clouds moving overhead. We're going to have a lot more of those late tonight through early tomorrow. Not a great chance for any wet weather tonight or tomorrow morning. But as we get through the day on Thursday, we'll have more and more of those clouds pushing overhead. We'll have some spotty rain showers. Here's this time tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening, some light rain showers possible. Many places though, not even seeing a drop and that potential will still be there through the overnight hours Friday into early Friday morning. We'll still have some showers, but we're going to lose those clouds fairly rapidly. So by this time on Friday afternoon, we're going to start losing those clouds, but not much rain on our forecast. So it would be nice to have this much. This is our finer resolution model, bringing most places measurable rain, but you'll notice that the valley between a hundredth of an inch and a quarter of an inch, a little bit over the mountains, but not much more than that. So if you want to get your car washed, you'll probably want to wait a couple more days for that. Don't worry about doing it tomorrow or or Friday, but by Saturday, our weather should be drying out a little bit more. Coming up in our next half hour, we'll be our extended forecast looking at other chances for some rain coming our way. Here's your forecast for tomorrow, though. We'll have increasing clouds, scattered rain showers in our forecast, and it won't be very warm. Highs in the northern mountains will only reach the 50s with very little sunshine in the sky. For the northeastern part of our state, we'll have lows tonight in the chillier 20s and 30s. Highs tomorrow mainly in the 50s, also a chance for showers, but that's going to be late in the day on Thursday. For the the ridge, the temperatures are not going to change very much. We'll have lows tonight, mostly in the 40s. Highs, look at that. 40s and lower to mid 50s. Again, a chance for showers mainly during the evening and overnight hours Thursday going into Friday. For the valley, we'll have a chance for some fog, especially the further south you live. Lows tonight in the 40s. Highs will not be as warm as today. Mid to upper 50s with some scattered showers around Shasta County and Tehama County and for the Glen and Butte County areas. Lows tonight under a little bit more of a fog blanket will be in the 40s. Daytime highs about 10 degrees warmer. Not warming very much with that lack of sunshine. Highs in the mid to upper 50s. Next seven days in Chico, we'll still have a chance for some showers early Friday morning and then clearing that sky by this coming weekend with highs climbing back into the 60s. More breezes early next week, too. And for the Redding area, upper 50s tomorrow and Friday. Some gusty wind on Saturday and next Tuesday. But the highs will be back to the seasonable range in the 60s by the weekend. Thanks,